Police say a Largo man preyed on a young girl at a local clothing store, following her into the dressing rooms and shooting video as she undressed. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith live tonight in Largo. And Ryan, the young victim, saw that camera. And Jameson police telling us tonight, thankfully, the victim spotted this man's cell phone very quickly. Unfortunately, it was recording her every move inside that dressing room. Police also telling us he even tried to cover up the crime. Police say 33 year old Ian Ehrlich targeted a teenage girl. The investigative report says Ehrlich asked to try on clothes in a dressing room at this Plato's closet on Ulmerton Road in Largo. Once inside, officers say he admitted to putting his cell phone under the dressing room next to him, recording an underage girl. I think it's really demeaning and awful to think that you can't go to a public place and expect privacy in a dressing room. It's enough to make shoppers re-examine how they try on clothes. And it makes me feel uncomfortable going somewhere that doesn't have completely closed doors um, and, you know, expecting myself to be safe. Police tell us the victim saw a cell phone recording her and immediately alerted store employees. Ehrlich is out of jail on bond, so we stopped by his house just steps from a Largo Elementary School to hear what he had to say about his arrest. Hi, is Ian home? But family inside had no comment. Back at the store, the owner tells me she's thankful her employees acted swiftly, calling police, helping put this man in jail. I'm glad that something was done about it because a lot of times it doesn't go seen or known. Investigators also charging this man with tampering with evidence. Detectives telling us tonight that before they could get to this store to make an arrest, he actually deleted that recording right off his cell phone. Live tonight in Largo, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.